This is my FAF 230 and I made a new motor drive to it. It have got a pressure controlled pedal. So I just want to show you that. It got a silicone tubing there and uh, when I press this uh, it will start to move. Actually when I when I have it like that with no pressure I can move uh, the hand wheel like this but when I press it a little bit then the motor takes over and then uh, it's it's not possible to move it by hand anymore so uh, you need to release the foot pedal in order to use your hand now you see I start the machine with a pedal and I am able to start it here with very slow speed. I can control it down to about two to three stitches a minute. Very slow. And it is actually nice when you like to position the needle just above where it should go into the fabric. It, uh, this is definitely uh, possible. Now I will increase the speed to max speed slowly. This is max speed and it is about 1800 stitches per minute. Okay, now I will show that I can make some short moves by just kicking to the pedal here. And I can control it just like a I want. Then it also got needle stop. It has actually got four kind of needle stop. I'll uh, set it to needle down now. And now it goes down and uh, it catches the thread with the hook and goes a bit up again. And the, uh, the stop is very precise here. I just make a small kick and then it moves to the next stop. I can also uh, press one more and then it's up. So now it stops in the up position and that's the max up. And then I can uh, have both positions so uh, when I make a small kick, it will just go to the next position. This is six layers of some quite heavy tarpaulin. And then you can see how it reacts to, to load variations. So now I make it go slow here. And it's like it, you can't see at all uh, that uh, these load variations do anything. It has plenty of, of uh, force here. No problem at all. The needle here is a 140 needle. Now I do a heavy sewing test. 
Det is with an M20 polyester thread, a 140 slash 22 needle and six layers of vinyl. First I will lock the stitch. Actually it, it hits the the foot there. Okay, and then I go forward. Reverse again. Now that it hits the. When I go reverse, I have a problem with the needle hitting the foot there. There again. Okay. And then I just see how it looks like. And uh, it's the lower line there. I think it's uh, a nice stitch. And uh, when I take the lower side, I think it's reasonable balanced. I can't see any red here. Yeah. So uh, it seems okay. And it has got plenty of power to do that.